I just want to tell everybody that your health is more important than anything. Like, whether you have the money or not, whether you have, you know, trouble going to the dentist or whatever it is, it's like there's no better reason than to go get this done because of I'm going to talk to you guys about uh, my teeth and, you know, going through the process and all that stuff. I'm uh, 26. Uh, I've had, I had braces for five years. I had um, dental surgery done on a couple teeth. Um, I had gotten a root canal and a crown on one side and my teeth were just breaking and they looked terrible and I just was over it. Um, so I decided to get fake teeth. Uh, yesterday I got 14 teeth on top pulled. Um, and then I had eight on the bottom pulled. And I got immediate dentures, which are already in, obviously. Um, I'm, I have a pretty high pain tolerance as it is. Um, I'm not, my mouth isn't really bleeding very much anymore. Um, and that it's uh, 9 p.m. right now. I got them done at around 3 p.m. yesterday. So it's been a little over 24 hours. I mean, it's been about 30 hours or whatever. Um, it's very stressful to get it done. Uh, I had a hard time relaxing um, getting the Novocaine shots and all that stuff. Um, I would say the Novocaine shots are the worst part, definitely. Uh, just getting the shots done was just, it sucked. It wasn't terrible. It wasn't the worst thing in the world, but do I want to do it again ever? No. <laughs> um, but yeah, getting the shots sucked a little bit, but after, like, once you're completely numb, I'm um, gonna start pulling your teeth. It's not. It's not as bad as you would think. Like, they had trouble with mine. Mine were very broken, and he was he was having some problems. But you know, at the end of the day, it's worth it. <laughs> it's hard to talk. It's weird. It's. I feel. I haven't been talking very much either so I haven't really been getting used to it but um, my denture is actually for being the temp is pretty close to what my teeth looked like other than my front teeth look a little big but all my side teeth are pretty much the same as what my teeth looked like before but just not busted um, so I got all the tops all the tops are pulled and then the bottoms the backs are all pulled and I kept six in the front just because the stability helps a lot and my front teeth aren't bad so they're like if you can keep them keep them I was like all right that's fine but it's weird with the, the swelling and the plates being in my mouth trying to talk is very difficult it feels like I don't have very much room for my tongue but I feel like over time I'll get more used to it especially because how swollen it is and it's hard you guys can't tell obviously but my bite doesn't line up right but it's to be expected because it was literally yesterday that I got this done um, I went to um, affordable dentures uh, and I'm going to be spending quite a bit of money for my perms because I want to, I don't want to look like I have fake teeth, especially because I'm not even 30. Um, but you know, it is what it is. The, uh, the pain isn't terrible. Um, as of yesterday and today, like the most pain I think I was in was last night. I, uh, last night I took, um, half of a either Viking or Percocet one or the other whatever I took half of one and then a few hours later I took another half of one and then um, slept through the night 
I fell asleep around 1 a.m., 1 or 2 a.m. I woke up at 9 or 10, um, took another half of one, and I think around 4 or 5 today, I took another half of one, and now it's 9. Um, my teeth are, my gums are a little sore, but not terrible. Um, the swelling is pretty minimal. My face right here is kind of swollen. Um, my jaw hurts from when they pulled the teeth, like holding my mouth open, but all in all, the pain is not anything like I thought it would be. I thought it'd be like excruciating. To be honest, my teeth hurt worse before getting them pulled than it does now having them all pulled out because I had like exposed nerves and stuff like that and just the busted, gross, infected teeth hurt worse than just having them all yanked out of my head basically it's just open cut or whatever it is you know g gaping holes um feels better so that's something to look forward to but uh yeah it doesn't hurt that bad um it is weird trying to get used to it it's weird not being able to feel um but it's not that bad like i, I I feel like I'm already getting used to it and it hasn't even been 24 hours and I'm getting used to being able to talk and, you know, biting down it does hurt a little bit on my gums, but, you know, once it heals and you go in, get relines and get everything all figured out, you know, how they, how your denture sits in your mouth isn't going to stay the way it is right now. Like mine is so loose and I can move my teeth. <laughs> Um, it won't be like that. I have uh, a friend that had this done, his tops, and uh, he said it wasn't that bad, so I was like, fuck it, I'm just going to do it. Um, and, uh, yeah, I definitely, <laughs> I'm, I'm glad I did it. Uh, my teeth were really bad. Um, as far as eating, um, I drank some soup today i ate um it was hard but i ate a zebra cake uh i've been drinking um these insure things um it's just like a protein shake with vitamins and stuff like that but i figured if i can't eat i might as well drink something that has vitamins and stuff in it and try to keep myself from keeling over before i can even heal um, <laughs> I don't know what else to say. Uh, if you're afraid to do it, don't be afraid to do it. Like, you're, if your teeth are bad enough to where you're getting infections and stuff like that, it's time to just go and do it. Um, it's, it sucks to have to have dentures, and especially if you're young and do it. It sucks, but it's like... You feel so much better after it's done. Like, even for me, I can barely talk right now. I'm like, <laughs> but I look so much better. Like, looking at myself, like, having nice-looking teeth is is a good feeling. Like, it, I can't, I can't even describe how bad my teeth were. And then now I have like the perfect teeth. Like it's crazy. Um, but yeah, that's like the Novocaine shots suck. I'm not gonna lie to you. It it sucks. It's not the it's not the worst thing in the whole fucking world, but it does suck. Um, but once you're numb and they start pulling and it doesn't, you don't feel anything. The only thing you feel, you know, if you're holding your mouth open and they're fucking pulling on your jaw, of course it's going to be, you know, a little painful. But it's not, it's not nearly as bad as I thought it was going to be. I, I, I put this off for five years. Uh, my teeth were, I wouldn't say terrible, but they were bad. I mean, they were black. I don't know Broken. All my bottom teeth were black and broken. Um, it was just, it was bad. It was, um, 
I'll throw pictures in, but um, yeah, it's just, just do it. Just, if you think you want to do it and you're afraid to do it, just do it. I'm telling you, it was not worth being afraid of doing. I put it off for so long until my health was at risk. And now, after doing it, I'm like, why did I put it off for so long? You know, it's like I, I could have already gotten the healing process over with. I could have my perms put in and I could look perfectly, you know, normal. I not have to worry about my health anymore. Um, that's just, that's the biggest thing is your health. I mean, it, your health is everything. And if your teeth are that bad to where you're getting infections, and you know, you get the throbbing headaches and all that stuff. I mean, you can get very sick and even die from that stuff. So if I were you, if you're debating on doing it, or if you think that, you know, you're afraid or you think it's going to be too painful or whatever I'm, it's just it's it's not worth putting yourself at risk just go and do it i mean i had i went to the emergency room to get antibiotics because my teeth were hurt so bad that i had like temple pain and i just decided that i was like all right if i'm if i'm going to the er to get antibiotics because i'm afraid of an infection it's time to just get rid of my teeth and uh, it was definitely it's worth it. It's it's seriously like I can't even describe how happy I am. And it's like for being as young as I am or whatever, it's 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 so worth it. Just if you have any doubts, just get rid of it and just go do it. Um, of course, it's life changing. You know, it's like no more chewing gum, no more this, no more that. But it's like. There's no, I don't have a lot of money. There's no, there's no quick fix or anything. You just gotta go do it, you know? I, I couldn't afford to fix my teeth. Uh, when I'm 26 and when I was 19 or 20, I went to the doctor and they told me it was $25,000 to fix my teeth. And um, uh, being 20 years old and being told it was gonna cost me, you know, 20 grand I was like <laughs> yeah right I that's 10 times the amount of cost of my car at the time I was like you're insane um so yeah I put it off for a very long time uh it wasn't that it wasn't even like I couldn't afford it now but I knew I couldn't not do it I went and got um care credit which is um, basically for like dental care and stuff like that. Some places will take it, some don't. If you're looking to get dentures and you don't have the money for it, I would definitely look into getting care credit so that we can do it with payments. Um, but that also depends on where you go and what dentist you use or anything like that. Um, but yeah, without that care credit stuff, I wouldn't have been able to do this. But I have pretty good credit as it is. So then when I asked for care credit or whatever, I filed for it, whatever, and they gave me um, a pretty good limit and everything. So that covered, you know, all the work that I got done. And then I'm sure we'll, um, we'll also, once I pay it down more or whatever, it'll cover my perms when I get those done as well. And whoever knows how long, six to 12 months or whatever it is, I don't know. Um, but yeah, um, I would just, I just want to tell everybody that your health is more important than anything. Like, whether you have the money or not, whether you have, you know, trouble going to the dentist or whatever it is, it's like, there's no better reason than to go get this done because for me I was scared to the point where I couldn't eat you know I, I couldn't eat I couldn't do anything I drank cold hot water anything it's just insane pain and I, I, I just had to do it and if I don't like going to the dentist um, I've always had a problem with the dentist but to just go and get it done and be done with it now and just all I have to do now is heal uh, it's the best thing I could have done um, 
if you guys have any questions or anything, I'm pretty, uh, I'm frequently on my YouTube and everything like that. So if you have any questions to ask or anything, leave a comment and I will answer whatever I can. Uh, that's all. That's my little 15 minute rant on my teeth. Um, if you have any questions, just let me know.